been looser, hasn't it? So I think we're more uh, yeah. in this mode at the moment. We're not very good at like set lists. We're very loose. Steve, your uh, your lyrics um, are they all your own? Uh, yeah, I mean the lyrics the lyrics come from all over the band, so it's not only me that writes lyrics. Yeah, yeah, they're all our own. We, we do all our own lyrics and stuff like that. We don't take anything from anyone else. We just, we just do our own thing. It's totally it's, I mean, it's original as original can be. I mean, we, none of us go out to like, none of us try and copy or anything like any sound. It's just whatever happens, happens. It tricks on. I think if we were saying we was in a, if we was in the 70s or uh, the gong era, maybe we emulate gong or the Floyd sometimes. Yeah, people said that. Yeah, right. It could be said. But it was, we'd never do a, we'd never do covers. You know, it's not worth it. We can make that sound. It's, so if you were it's to like actually a minimalist approach to a full blown band thing, we would make the same sort of music if we were playing with acoustic instruments or just the yeah. drum. Yeah, that's it. It's if you were to. Uh, if you could, if you were to pigeonhole yourselves in the style of music you play and the lyrics of the songs, where would you place yourself uh, in the current music arena? Right. I've got my theory on music. Yeah, trash, support trash, trash, trash theory, theory, right? Support side of It's small bands at the bottom and big bands at the top. You've got the classification of music, I don't know, what would you call it? We're, we're, the, we're the underbelly garage of music. Well, we've, we've, we've gone garage, garage, trash. Um, info trash. Yeah, in info trash. Fucking totally mad bastards on lots and lots of drugs. Uh, you know, we're the fucking, we're the pit, we're the gut of music, we're the gut of instinct. That's what we are. Yeah. So you'd say you're more of an indie band? Yeah, it's from the gut, man. What? No, it's not uh, in the band. It's from the gut. From the gut. It's from the gut, yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a feeling from within. That's a, That's it's the pit of your space. stomach when you're just about to be sick. It's the movements of your body in its state. That's right. When you're throwing up, when you've had too much to drink, that's the fucking mammoth. All across the fucking pavement. <laughs> He's a spaz, isn't he? <laughs> Steve? Yeah, no, I <laughs> no. I think we should we go back in and do some more? Uh, okay, all right then. Yeah, we'll go back in. Cheers, guys. All right, smart. <laughs> right, wait a minute. Hello, Slack Mammoth Enterprises. Hello? <laughs> Hello? What's that, a death threat? What? 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 No! What? What? Hey, you loony! Get off the line! <laughs> oh, fucking nutters. Ringing you all the time. You know how it is, Nick, yeah? It's like, you know, they just ring you up and there's death threats, man, because the, because because Sparks played out of tune on that last song. The last song, you know, the one that was the greatest song of the set. The, the song that we wanted to, to uh, break into the hearts of the nation. And they just ring you up and give you this shit. Halston Pills! So, Peter. Ah, oh, there he is, young man. Ah, shades on, shades nice. off. So, we will conduct our interview with the cameraman at precisely one hour, three minutes, and 38 seconds into this particular segment of time. Really you cannot there. escape. You as well. There are armed guards surrounding the building. So how much are you going to pay me for this interview? Steve, how much? I think we have him here and uh, we're holding him hostage. This is the Slack Mammoth Liberation Front. We're holding the cameraman hostage. We're holding your cameraman hostage. We're not going to let anyone out of the building. We will kill the lead guitarist of the other band if anyone, Wait, anyone, Baba next. anyone, Oops, oops, yeah, right, I lost Anyone it. declares war right. on this Okay, building. don't shout, man, because there's a little baby next door for having its feet, so. Steve. There you go, you nutter. It always happens, doesn't it? So, anyway, on to our interview with this man.
superimposing thing on on, the, on it sort of thing for live you know what I mean can you superimpose uh, say if Matt is drumming and it's at the height <laughs> of uh, ecstasy as you capture him and it superimposes over the rest of the band sort of thing not while the uh, oh right what's going on no that's uh, you can do that video and fix it that's excellent man. Down there, though. It's probably the best place for it, actually. 